Hello and welcome to Contemporary Philippine Arts from the Regions. I am Armin Rose and I will be your guide as we go through the concepts of this course. This is Part 12, Different Contemporary Art Techniques and Performance Practices. In this video, we will talk about medium, technique, tools, style, subject, and theme. Medium Medium is the material, or the substance, out of which a work is made. Through these materials, the artist expresses and communicates feelings and ideas. The medium also defines the nature of the art form. On the basis of medium, arts can be classified in nature as follows. We have the musical arts, wherein we can find music, poetry, and dance. The practical arts, design, architecture, furniture, and fashion design. Environmental arts, architecture, sculpture, installations, and public art. Pictorial arts, painting, printing, film, photography, stage, and production design. Narrative arts, drama, literature, film, dance, auditory arts, music, poetry, theater, and film. Technique. Technique is the manner in which artists use and manipulate materials to achieve the desired formal effect and communicate the desired concept or meaning according to his or her personal style. The distinctive character of the medium or its nature determines the technique. Technique involves the use of tools, ranging from the most traditional to the most contemporary. Tools Tools are instruments that help the artist manipulate the medium in order to create art. These are examples of artist tools for visual arts in painting and sculpture. These are examples of artist tools for industrial and fashion design. These are examples of artist tools for pottery and architecture. Different media of art. Visual arts painting. The painter uses pigments like watercolor, oil, tempera, textile paint, acrylic, ink, charcoal, pencils, etc. on a flat ground like wood, canvas, paper, stone, or wall. Paintings are classified as two-dimensional art because they are flat. They only have length and width. Paintings are unique and one of a kind. These are examples of pigments as media. And these are examples of the surface used as media. Visual arts printing. The printmaker uses ink transferred on a surface like wood, metal, plates, or silk screen that is in keeping with the duplicating or reproducing process. Prints are also classified as two-dimensional art. Prints can be reproduced in several predetermined editions. These are examples of the plate and silk screen as medium in printing. And these are examples of woodblock and metal printing. Sculpture. The sculptor uses metal, wood, stone, clay, and glass. Sculptures fall within the category of three-dimensional arts because they occupy space and have volume. Examples of sculpture include nudes, figures, ritual objects, and carvings of saints in Christian churches. The marble sculpture is an example of a sculpture where you subtract from your medium by chiseling out parts to create the figure. The metal sculpture is an example of a sculpture where you add to your sculpture 
by welding out more metal pieces to create your figure. Other medium for sculpture includes sand and glass, as well as soap and fruits. Architecture. The architect uses wood, bamboo, bricks, stone, concrete, steel, cloth, and various other building materials. Buildings are also three-dimensional arts. However, architecture has the added element of time since we move into the structures. Architecture covers all buildings, towers, bridges, houses, churches, roads, and docks. Here we have an example of local materials used as medium for the Bahay Kubo and marble as the medium for the Taj Mahal temple. Glass is used for the pyramid in the Louvre and ice is used for igloos. Concrete is used as the main medium for the London Bridge, and steel is the main medium for the Eiffel Tower. Music. The musician uses sound and instruments, including the human voice. Musical instruments are classified as string, woodwind, brass, and percussion. Music is a performance art. Musical instruments, the string, Woodwind, brass, and percussion, as well as the voice, are the mediums of music. Dance. The dancers uses the body and its movements. Dance is often accompanied by music, but there are dances that do not rely on music. Dance can tell stories, but at other times, they convey abstract ideas that do not rely on a narrative. Dance is also a performance art. The dancer's body and the movements are the medium used in dance. Theater. The theater artist integrates all the arts and uses the stage, production design, performance elements, and script to enable the architectural, visual, musical, dance, and other aspects to come together as a whole work. The theater uses several mediums of art to create a performance on stage. Photography and cinema. The photographer uses a single reflex camera. The SLR camera is available in film in negative form and in digital format. The filmmaker uses the cinematographic camera. It is available in film through the celluloid medium and video and digital format. Film puts together production design, sound, engineering, performance, and screenplay. In digital format, the images can be assimilated into a computer, thus eliminating the need for celluloid or negatives, processing chemicals, and print. The camera is the tool of the photographer, and the film is the medium of recording the images. The film camera is the tool of the director and the celluloid is the medium of recording the images. The video camera is another tool for recording moving images. It uses the VHS, Betamax, Hi8, Video8, Mini DV or Compact C video cassettes for storing the images. Literature. The writer uses words to create art. They produce fiction or non-fiction works like novels, poetry, essay, and script. All written works have literary elements. The medium of literature is the written word and is recorded through the use of pen and paper, the typewriter, or the computer.
Other art forms. The designer, performance artist, and installation artist combine and use the range of materials in the previous slides. The medium of fashion design includes all the materials needed to create clothing, accessories, bags, shoes, hats, and makeup. The medium for interior and landscape design includes various architectural mediums, furniture, and plants. The medium for public art and outdoor installation include metal, concrete, and fiberglass. Stage well to fit perfectly with the surroundings. For indoor installation art, Artists can use whatever medium they like. In this installation by Medeo Cruz entitled Politeismo, he used several items uh, that are indigenously found, like the crucifix, a big rosary, uh, posters of Jesus and saints, flashcards of Filipino heroes, cutouts from magazines of actors and actresses, stickers of cartoon characters, the flag, and other materials. Now this installation art has been banned for uh, having an image in a discrete corner that angered a lot of patrons, including the Catholic Church, because it is uh, an ashtray that can be bought in Baguio of a man's penis and there were ballers from politicians that they give out during election period that he stuck into the ashtray but what angered the the church the most is that this ashtray was stuck to the nose of an image of Jesus Christ and that is what got it banned now I will show you the image in the next slide, very quickly. This is the offending image in the installation that got it banned. Performance art can also use several mediums, like this one by Marina Abramovic entitled Rhythm Zero, performed in 1974. For this performance, the artist will stand perfectly still for one hour. Beside her is a table where several materials can be seen from the picture and the audience can interact with the artist using any material found on the table. So there were safe materials in there, seemingly innocent ones like feathers and fruits, bread, a flashlight, a camera, a hat, but not seen in the picture are also some rather unsafe materials like razor blades, scissors, a gun, and a bullet. Now there were security people to ensure that everyone involved in the performance art will remain safe. Now the object of this performance is to prove that people can become increasingly violent when there are no repercussions to their actions. Now for the first few minutes of her performance, she was standing perfectly still and the people are just looking at her. But the first person to, to take an item from the table took a feather and proceeded to tickle her with it. Now when, when someone started in the initiated interaction, several people followed all doing taking innocent items from the table at first but as time went on they the people became increasingly hurtful with their actions they were taking the unsafe materials and using it on her some were cutting her with the thorns from the flowers they're writing unkind words on paper and taping it on her body 
uh, some even cut off some of her hair and someone cut off her clothes. There was one person who actually took the bullet, put it in the gun and aimed it at her, although he did not really fire it. Now for all these actions, the artist remained perfectly still. The only thing she cannot control were her tears that were flowing down her eyes as the people were doing increasingly unkind acts to her that violated her as a person. Now at the end of the one hour, Marina started to move and everyone who did something to her ran out of the room, ran out of the building because they did not want to face the repercussions of what they did, which exactly proved her point or the point of the performance. In the next slide, I'm going to show you an image of the artist a few seconds before the end of the time period when she was supposed to move. She is in a very sad and sorry state, and it might offend some people. I apologize in advance. This is Marina a few seconds before she moved. Now, because of what happened during this first performance, the show was never repeated again. Integrated art. Art forms can be integrated, such as in design, like interior design, fashion design, and landscape design. Also in mixed media, photography, film, and video, performance art, theater production, and installation art. Art forms in such settings cannot be separated into distinct forms. It is collectively created and consumed. On the other hand, there are integrated artworks made by individual artists practicing in the various arts. The UB Chapel was designed by architect Leandro Loxin. The crucifix was sculpted by Napoleon Abueva. The floor mosaic was done by Arturo Luz. The Stations of the Cross were painted by Vicente Maranzala and Ang Kyoko. In 1968, a concert was performed there by composer Jose Maceda. All these people are national artists who contributed to creating the church. These are pictures of the exterior and interior of the UP Chapel designed by architect Leandro Loxin. This is the crucifix and the floor mosaic. And these are the actual paintings as seen on the walls. Style. Style is the distinctive manner which permits the grouping of works into related categories. It is the recognizable way in which an act is performed or an artwork is made. Here are examples of artworks the techniques used, and the style that is produced by said technique. Now, no technique is exclusive to a style. For example, floor work is not exclusive to break dancing, because floor work can also be used for tap dancing. Their difference being how the floor is used for the dance. It's also applicable for all the other techniques and styles in the other artworks. Subject matter. Subject and art refers to what they are all about. It answers the questions, what do we see, hear, taste, and touch? If there is an image, we identify that image and recognize how it is represented. The image may be figurative or representational, which means that the image is drawn from the world around us. The image may also be abstract, non-figurative, or non-representational, meaning it does not have a recognizable subject. Its subject is its form and elements. Theme. Theme is what connects the subject to the social milieu. There are many ways of determining the theme of an artwork. At the most obvious level, we note its data, 
the title, artist, medium, dimension, and year it was made. Beyond these are the texts, images, allusions, and symbols that clue us in to the social and historical context referred to. It is at this level that the thematic plane operates. Themes go beyond the literal, or what we see at the surface level with the five senses. We need to see the work within a larger context. Depending on many factors, themes can also intersect, since a single artwork can encompass and resonate with several themes. Some of the more popular themes in the Philippines include heroism, identity, ecology, spirituality, and everyday life. I do not own the pictures seen in this video. Credit for these pictures belong to their owners. The ideas discussed in this video are based on the content standards of the Department of Education. Thank you for watching and see you in the next lesson.